And the dictatorship period of torture was a big thing because a lot of people suffered that. And uh, still a, a lot of people coming to the museum and suffer the torture and they cannot go in because they are not able to see everything. Sometimes they stay uh, days, weeks uh, without light, uh, for example, and then uh, has to go out. So they suffer things in the eyes. I know, for example, they put uh, two brothers in front of the parents and they have to see everything. Total. The violations, the violations, for example, were, was horrible. My family lived that. I have uh, exiled parents in Canada. It's difficult when you have uh, some family in other places and you are here, so it's difficult because uh, sometimes you, you want to stay together and you cannot. And a, lo a lot of people here in the museum uh, love the museum because uh, we know it's uh, our history. In the dictatorship period, nobody can see different things in the TV. Uh, everything that uh, the government said, we have to see it. So affected everything in the thinking of the people here. So for example, uh, some uh, Chilean people don't know the museum is here. Don't care about it because they still thinking uh, dictatorship period was uh, okay for Chile, everything was perfect, Every, everybody was happy with that. Children don't know nothing about what happened last years because their family never said nothing about it. Now we have things like a museum or uh, you can see another kind of things in the, on TV about the real history. Some people come to the museum and say, yesterday I saw uh, something in the, on the TV and uh, I, uh, we never uh, thinking that things happened here before, so I want to know the history. We're getting better, step by step.